space to cultivate focus, strength, self-awareness. So you want to stretch through your armpit, stretch through your ribcage. I'm in the Smoky Mountains for a week with a few other influencers, and this morning we had a private yoga instructor come to the cabin to teach us yoga. And then once the yoga session was over, I came back to my room to open up the curtains and get ready for the day. During the yoga session, the instructor called out three words that really stuck with me, and I wanted to turn them into affirmations. One of the words is focused. I am focused on my goals this year. A lot of the times when I make goals, I just keep them in my head. I don't write them down. So this year I made it a point to write down every single one of my goals. So that way I can always go back to my journal and just check them off. One of my biggest fears is public speaking. And you wouldn't think that with what I do here on YouTube because I talk in every single one of my videos, but that's because it's so easy because I'm in the room alone talking to a camera. But one thing that I really wanna work on is just being in a room with a lot of people and joining in on the conversations. So during this trip, we had a lot of deep conversations and some of the time I would just sit there and listen and agree on a lot of things, but I wouldn't speak on a lot of things because of the discomfort in talking. So that's one major thing that I'm working on um, this year for myself is just learning how to be in a room full of people and joining in on all of the conversations. Another word that really stood out to me during the yoga session was strength. I could have wrote I am strong, but I wanted to dig deeper into the word and focus on something that I have been working on, which is my inability to remain positive in a lot of situations. Any little inconvenience, I'm always down and out about it. So this year I am telling myself that choosing to remain positive is my most powerful form of strength. Before we talk about the last affirmation that I wrote down, I want you guys to comment down below what are a few affirmations that have helped you so far in 2023. I would love to read them and write them down in my journal as well. So the last one I wrote down was self-awareness and I ended up writing a little list under this one, but there's one thing I wanna share with you that may help you as well. I wrote down that I am learning what makes me feel more alive and fulfilled and doing more of it. So any little thing that makes you happy, any little thing that fulfills you, make sure you're doing that for yourself this year. Mm -hmm.